Hello friends, welcome back to Life of Electronics YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to show you my entire solar setup in rooftop. This is a very 445 watts single monoperc half cut panel with the output ampere rate about 10 amps. The two terminals of positive and the negative connected with a MC4 connector that is most commonly a solar panel connecting with this type of connectors. That's called MC4 connectors. And I am using a 6mm square DC cable to uh, deliver the DC current to my MPPT. I am using Luminous Echo Volt Neo 1550. It delivers approximately 1500 watts. And I am using a Tata uh, company battery. This is not a C10 battery. Uh, in the next month, I will going to upgrade uh, the C20 battery into C10 battery because uh, most of the solar panels uh, uh, with C10 battery giving more performance. And while connecting the C20 battery in the solar panels, it will damage the battery uh, because uh, the C20 battery is not built for the solar panel. And the MPPT is using us uh, Asha Power MPPT. I ordered this from the online website Asha Power. Uh, you can also check the uh, website of Asha Power to order this MPPT. This is the variant of uh, Asha Power uh, Surya 60HV. It can deliver up to 60 amps and the input VOC is about uh, 140 at the 24 volt and uh, approximately 120 volt in uh, 12 volt supply. Okay, uh, and the solar panel is connected and the grid is connected. Uh, this is the MCB uh, to turn on and off the solar panel connection. I am using uh, Chint 40 amps. MCB DC MCB it can handle the uh, total DC uh, breakdown and turn on uh, if any uh, thunderstorm or any striking uh, lightning something it happen I can uh, turn it off and the total wire is covered with the pipes you can see that actually the red LED is blinking it means the battery is getting charging 